this just came about a little while ago. Anyways, I today is my rest day in my program. I don't do rest day very well and this is something that's super 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 crazy for me because it's not like I've just always been this workout person you know whatever but I did always have a lot of anxiety so when I started this journey you know a few years ago I know that I felt amazing but the thing is is that I was working out later in the day at that time or like whenever I kind of got around to it and so that's why when I started as I was talking about yesterday like why it's so important to stick to your routine I created my own routine and that was to be a morning workout person and I don't really know why at the time like well I do know why I know that I knew that I felt so amazing after I worked out and I know that at the time I was sleeping in until AJ woke up basically I wasn't getting out of bed until AJ got out of bed right like that's what moms do right you're like well I'm gonna just sleep or lay here even if you're not sleeping you're gonna lay in bed until the kid gets up um, and I think that was the worst thing that could have happened for me because I was so excited and proud you know that I was a stay-at-home mom and and you know I was very very short and I had a ton of anxiety at times or if nap time didn't go well you know I just was like kind of crippled with anxiety and then I was having that that mom remorse and guilt of like being angry and you know sometimes feeling like maybe I shouldn't have decided to be a, a stay-at-home mom and so it was really really hard for me to be happy all day long with being home with AJ okay so I decided one day like okay well I have to work out in the morning and so that's what I've done that's what I do every single morning and on the program that I'm doing now there is a rest day that's written into the program and the rest day is important because I don't know if you guys are watching or have seen but I'm lifting pretty heavy or at least it's very heavy for me so my body needs to rest and I also teach cycle on Friday nights and stuff like that so I you know I contemplating taking my rest day on Friday because AJ is off school on Tuesdays and Thursdays so with Thursday being my rest day we're home all day long okay I love my kid more than anything in the whole wide world but if I don't work out in the morning I'm stressed out all day long right so here's kind of like our situation AJ loves his mom I love him like it's amazing but like he just kind of always wants to do what I'm doing right he wants to like he wants to sit on the counter in the kitchen with me while I'm doing the dishes and he wants to just always be there and you know not always necessarily help but he always wants to be right there and it's it's awesome like don't get me wrong I'm so glad that he still like always wants to be right by me but it's when I'm single parenting for the next year it's just a little bit too much so last week I did not take a rest day last week I you know I was like I just can't do it I have to work out or I'm gonna be super stressed out and you know so last week I well I took the rest day from my program but like I said that was on Friday when I teach cycle class so I kind of obviously kind of cheated the system there and was like okay well it's a rest day but it's not a rest day but I'm resting in the morning and so it counts right um, so this morning I did sleep in a little bit I slept until 7 because I've been up really late doing a bunch of other things for my business at night and you know that's awesome um, but I was like okay I'm gonna sleep in since I can't work out I got up and did my meditation and all of those other things that I do in the morning and worked for a little bit before he got up but it's just almost instantly like I can tell and so like some people are like well you're addicted or you know whatever and it's it's not I call it what you want it I don't know but what I do know is that it's very healthy to have a routine and to have a system and to be passionate about wanting to be healthy and so you know my sometimes very 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 anxiety filled brain um, does not like to take a rest day so what I had to do kind of earlier today is you know I used to take Xanax and I used to be on medications and I used to just kind of freak out and you know if you don't have anxiety it's really hard to explain some people think like maybe I had a panic attack once or maybe 
you know, I guess maybe I've had anxiety, but like it's very, very, very taxing on your body. Like when you're anxious, right? It's just like, like you're going to freak out. It's like a volcano almost inside. And I hate that because I have a lot of patience with my son and especially because I was very, very, very driven like he is. He's like a mini me and it kills me when I'm not patient. Like it kills me when I am short with him and it kills me when, you know, I'm just like, oh, like, you know, sometimes when I'm just thinking like, gosh, I just wish I had me time, you know, or whatever the case, like that's, I get really guilty about that. So anyways, the moral of the story is, you know, I probably am not going to be taking a total rest day. Like, I know that's what's supposed to happen in this program, but at least next week I'm going to have to do something, some abs or some yoga or, you know, whatever the case is. Um, I, my body is very sore. Um, so I know that it's good and it's what I should be doing, but it just, it's just brutal. Or I'm going to have to switch the day. Maybe I'll take Wednesday as my rest day, but anyways, that's kind of my confession of a, of a workout addict is that I hate rest days. And I feel kind of proud about that. I feel proud that I hate rest days because it just means that I really, 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 really do enjoy this. Um, and it's obviously very clear, you know, like I wouldn't be doing this. I wouldn't be, you know, so passionate and shooting, shouting it from the rooftops if this wasn't what I was really, truly, truly passionate about. So anyways, we, he is napping right now. I am working and we have a nice family night with his school tonight, a STEAM event, and so I'm looking forward to that. Um, but anyways, I just had to share with you guys because I just kind of wanted to cry a little earlier. Just wanted to cry. Just wanted, just wanted him to get dressed and brush his teeth. Why is it so hard? He could literally sit at the kitchen table for like the entire day. Like he can sit there all day long. I'm like, wouldn't you rather be playing? Wouldn't you rather go outside? Wouldn't you rather go to the P-A-R-K, sorry, the dog's right here. Like, wouldn't you rather do any of these things? Like, can't we just get dressed? Can't we just finish our breakfast? Can't we just brush our teeth? You know, like, let's get rolling. Let's get moving. Let's get outside. Let's do anything. <laughs> Please, let's do anything. So anyways, we did get, you know, we went for a little hike at the park and stuff like that, but don't give up on yourself. If you're finding it really, really hard to just find a routine and get into a groove, like, it's so important. It is so important for your sanity, like your mental well-being, not just your physical. It is so important overall. So I just wanted to share that with everybody. Please pray for me for the rest of the day.